Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we're going to be playing Badia, an early access game by SEMA4, and we are going to be starting a brand new game. I have done some testing for the game, and it definitely needs to be optimized more. There's some audio glitches, but still the game is actually not that bad. So we're going to start a new character. You will see that you have starter kits that you can do, so you can be a Bedouin, which is a native to the land. You can be a soldier, so if say you were uh, here because of the fact that you were part of the war, because it's during World War II, and uh, you got separated from your platoon, and now you're just trying to survive. You can be an explorer, someone who's looking for the Egyptian tombs, that kind of thing. Uh, you can be an aviator, someone who was flying and got shot down. Uh, I think this may be the route that we're going to go. And then this one just doesn't make any sense, so we're not going to do that one. <laughs> so uh, let's go ahead and bring his weight down, because I would think that he would be kind of um, dealing with some uh, situation <laughs> as far as food is concerned. We'll make him tall. And I'm really not going to mess with anything else. I think that's going to be fine. Uh, and let's start the game. Okay, so it looks like we are near a Bedouin camp. And uh, we're going to get over here. It's uh, 81 degrees. Wow, that is very odd <laughs> for a desert. But I will take it. And uh, since it is so, um, so oddly nice weather I shouldn't have to worry about my water or anything let's go ahead and hit tab real quick so it looks like uh, because it is not too hot uh, we won't be losing our thirst too fast it's negative uh, or we lose 1.5 percent I believe it is or I may be incorrect about that per 0.6 miles we travel uh, we lose one hunger 0.9 miles we travel and then uh, the 0 0.8 per point, uh, 1.2 miles we travel. We have a handgun, it looks like, a Luger. Uh, so is this a German, I guess? Uh, he has 16 rounds, or 15 rounds. Let's go ahead and get our gun out. Load that up. Okay, we're good to go there. Let's check our clothing. Uh, we have some layers, so if we wanted to, we could go ahead and unequip that. Unequip it, which is R. So there we go. It's We're not bringing up, but then we have a little bit of an issue with the clothing there. Kind of looks weird. Um, let's go ahead and also remove the hat. There we go. Not too bad. All right. Uh, do we have any consumables? No tools. We have a water bag, which is very important to us. So we're going to use this on one of these to go ahead and fill it up. This way we can travel away from uh, the camp without having to deal with coming back for water all the time. So that's amazing. Uh, let's just go ahead and remove that back off of there. Uh, we also have a knife, which is good for uh, skinning animals, and a wrench, I guess we can use as an axe uh, to cut trees, I'm, I'm guessing. Let's come over here real quick and see what it lets us do. If it lets us chop down a tree. Okay, yep. Doesn't have very much dur uh, durability, though. <laughs> We're all right down, it looks like, almost a 50%. There we go, and uh, yeah. So there's a guy here with a quest. Let's see what he has to has for us. He wants us to gather three gold ore. Ore is needed. A good price. Uh, 90 coins for three gold ore? Sure, we'll try to find it. Uh, are you saying that it's in your area? Is that what's happening? Um, for a second here, I thought that was a motorcycle, <laughs> but it's not. Uh, so let's go ahead and take the horse and then we're going to travel around a little bit. It seems like really isn't much here we can do. Uh, we're going to have to try to make our own way. So we have different trees available to us really close by. What in the world is that? 
That looks like a military vehicle. Looks like a burnt out military vehicle. It has 19 scrap. Nice. Okay. Let's go ahead and pick up some rock because we need a rock to make an actual axe, I believe. This pointer, this, maybe this pointer should be like a contrast to the color that we're actually uh, dealing with, which is really bright backgrounds. Maybe it should, it should be dark instead of like a white dot. Uh, but that's that maybe me. Uh, it looks fine right there, but it, it, if you look right there, you can barely even see it. And if this is some kind of aiming device for when we actually use the gun, that might not be a best uh, best idea. Let's go ahead and pick up tr these off of the ground as well. Again, very hard to see. All right. Pretty much what we want to do is we want to try to make a lean-to as soon as possible, but we're trying to also find other things like animals to, to uh, harvest and also ore. Uh, if we can find it. But this actually looks like a really good place to set up camp, to be honest. Uh, let's let's go ahead and do it. Let's see what we have here that we can build already. We have enough that we can build a lean-to. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, let's go ahead and build that right there. And then... See it is. See, we need more wood to be in. Uh, more wood. Oh, we can make this. Let's go ahead and make that there. And then uh, we're gonna need more rocks. Yeah, I didn't think we had enough for that. So now all we have to do is come up to these and build them. A lean to, and we got a rack to dry out furs and stuff. Let's grab some more trees. This thing is going to break in a second. There it goes. Let's craft a axe. Let's go into our inventory tools. All right, and we're gonna have to gather some more trees. So I'm just gonna go out and gather them. I don't think I can do anything with that. We should also gather some uh, stone as well, because we're gonna need that for campfires. All right, get our stamina. There we go. Can't believe it's like 70 degrees outside in the desert. It's kind of awesome. And it's 3 p.m., so it's not even dark out. Should mean that during the night it's going to freeze over. Which makes sense in the desert. Alright, I think we got enough rock. Uh, let's just gather some trees. Yeah, this whole throwing your whole body into an axe is not recommended if you are actually out and cutting down trees or cutting logs or anything along those lines. It's probably not a good idea to do it that way. It's probably 
you know, waste all your energy and I'm not going to be very happy about it in the morning. At least we're not, like, dying from heat. Yet. This <laughs> is going to happen, I'm sure. Man, that was a good group of uh, stuff. Let's go ahead and grab this. And we're going to just head back and see what we can make. We need a campfire. Uh, that is how we're going to actually... Where is our lean-to? Oh, look at that. Look at that. And that. Just one. Pretty sure I hit him. <sighs> really do not want to be shooting from this far away with a handgun. But I need the meat. Hey, uh, apparently I missed him. Keeps traveling further and further away from me. Oh, he's at low health too. I have no clue where he did. Oh, he's just right there. He's right there. Got him. Holy cow. Can't believe we got him. There's another arrow. Okay, we got deer hide. This ended up being a really good place. And it looks like I lost that arrow to oblivion. So I can see where it goes in. Yep, I lost that arrow. Alright, well, we have our first meat. And hides and stuff. Uh, <laughs> that was actually uh, pretty pretty insane. I'm glad I didn't use the um, use the gun, because ammo is just gonna be such a pain to get. All right, we need drink. All right, let's put that away. We need to build a campfire. Actually, I'm going to build this on the other side. That's my regular campfire. This campfire 2.0. And then we go to C. And we make this right over top of that. And then... Do we have the wood? We don't. Uh, but we do have a tree right here. So I need to make a tool.
I don't know if you can hear that. That is the worst noise I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I can't. I can't tell if you can hear it or not, but it's a little chirping noise that whenever you go back and forth, and it just annoys the heck out of me. And I don't know if that's just me or if that's just something that's in the game that annoys anyone, but I don't like the chirping noise. Sadly. All right. So let's see, do we have enough now to build it? I need one more piece of wood. There's a tree over here and there's wood on the ground, I'm sure. Yep. Let's grab these rocks too. Alright, first thing we'll do is we'll make the fire I think is what it's going to make, yep, and then we'll make this, and we're going to come into here, and we're going to start the fire, and we're going to smelt this stuff up into iron. All right, and then in here, we're going to take the fur, we're going to turn that into cloth. And I think I'm going to keep the hides as they are. Oh, actually, yeah, we'll need to finish making this. And I'm going to have to get more trees. Uh, and we do want to save here, so let's go ahead and save. And that shouldn't take very long. Yep, and then we'll go ahead and grab all those. Throw those in. All right, and these should be done. Grab those, and that is going to stay for now. Uh, we need to craft the table. So we'll build this. Uh, we'll build this over here, kind of with our crafting stuff anyway. And then uh, build that. And then now we'll be able to build stuff like uh, we can build our own gun apparently. Takes a gun barrel, a weapon grip, a wood, and a trigger, a weapon grip. Um, let's go, I think resources, weapon grip, requires one hide, hide, and I have a hide on me, so don't know why that wouldn't work. Trigger takes... A little bit of metal and then lockpick takes scrap let's go ahead and craft two of those and then we could make a crossbow which is just out of iron we just need one more iron for it and then of course the wood maybe the crossbow is going to be better than the regular bow as far as um, getting the target or gain on target and then maybe the damage is better than the bow as well we can make buckshot out of metal a lot of metal being used here all right let's go ahead and grab that and i guess i just hit enter there we go and those will smelt up i guess we're gonna tan that and uh i'm gonna go look i'm gonna go grab some more wood so I can um, make a crossbow. We're low. Oh yeah, we need to. We need to take the metal that we have. Actually, we need wood. We need wood. Either way, we need wood. It's just gonna say we can make a uh, a thing to go over our other fire, and that will go towards being a um, a pot for cooking food. Yeah, this whole overhand throwing a baseball kind of chopping down wood thing is kind of weird. Let's 
72 degrees outside. We're thirsty and we're hungry at the moment, but we're, we have a good amount of time before we're really actually hungry. Why there would be a negative effect when our, our thirst is only at 50%, I have no clue, but it does it, so we're going to have to appease the gods of the game and, and get that resolved. All right. I go ahead and just walk back. There's no reason to waste uh, food and water. Yeah, I guess we'll run a little bit. Yeah, the game is uh, is as far as this. This is actually not that bad for for uh, crafting games. I feel cooking station. We're gonna take half that wood that we just made. There we go. And the next big thing that we're going to uh, work towards is a big tent. Let's go ahead and cook. Need to put some heat on here, but I don't know if there's a way to like combine ingredients to make uh, better cooked food. Let's go ahead and start the fire. And there we go. We have tanned. But with that quet or with this thing, it's gonna tell me that it needs hide. <laughs> doesn't want this hide that I made. Nor this. This uh, doesn't work either. Okay, this is a must. Let's go ahead and craft that. Out with the old and with the, wait a minute, where did where to go? There we go. Out with old and in with new. There we go. A real man's axe. <laughs> uh, we can make clothing if we wanted to. Out of the cloth. But I'm kind of saving that for bandages. Again, we can't make this without... So we may have to do some trading to be able to um, afford stuff. We can make bandit stuff. Knife, bone knife, copper knife, iron knife. What kind of we have? We just have a hunting knife, right? Yeah. All right, so food should be done, maybe. Oh yeah, that cooked really fast. 17 seconds, I'll go with that. All right, uh, so I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna sleep through the night uh, after we eat because it's kind of mad at us. Let's go ahead and eat. We are at 100, and now we're going to uh, consume some water. There we go. And is there something in here that I can use to... Um, it's about... I guess cold or heat and cold resistance takes one... And then a cross belt. Maybe that will add slots. Takes two, so we could use all of these. Let's go ahead and craft that. Craft this. Sounds like it's raining. And then we go into here under clothing. And we now have those, and it opens up extra slots, so we can now go ahead and put our gun here. Oh, and the other thing is that we were making a crossbow. An iron crossbow. We need three more wood and two more iron. Alright, we got the iron. And wow, that, that got dark quick. Let's go ahead and sleep. 
Uh, let's see. Food. Grab that. And let's sleep through the night. I'd sleep eight hours. You know, normal normal people sleep. And it's morning time. We're a little bit uh, thirsty, so let's go ahead and drink. There we go. And let's go chop down some trees with a new axe. Now, on the map, you when we go away from here, we'll, we'll actually see that if we look back, we now have a campfire. Campfire shows us exactly where our house is. It looks like there's something uh, 0.2 miles this way. Uh, so it's not very far. We'll go check it out. Uh, and it's thundering and lightning, so... Definitely making the the ground damp, which is always a good thing in a desert. Can't ever not need water. All right, let's see how this goes. This is taking almost no damage, if it's taking damage at all. All right, so that's cut down. Do we have enough? Uh, what was I making? A crossbow, that's right. Uh, inventory, resources, we have eight logs now. Let's go ahead and go back and make a crossbow. Actually, you know what? What in the world is that? Oh, that's just a, what? That's actually uh, a, what? A wheat field? Can you harvest it? And there's a water well here, too. What are you? It's a donkey. Can I ride the donkey? I want to ride the donkey. Can't ride the donkey, but I'm going to grab a drink. And uh, we'll go ahead and fill this up, too. Nice. We have a, a place close by that we can fill up water. And uh, looks like maybe a merchant over here. Acacia ointment. Huh. Uh, silk cocoon. And a uh, explorer bag. I don't have any money at the moment, but in the future maybe. And it has another uh, well over here. That kind of makes sense. If you're if you're gonna have a wheat field, you're definitely gonna have a place where you can feed your water. Uh, these foreign fighters are getting out of hand. We need to restore peace by driving them off. I, you know what? I'll do that for you, especially since you're gonna give me 500 monies. Let's go ahead and get back on our horse and see where this quest is, if we can find it on our map. Oh yeah, we have this this quest for gold ore. Let's go ahead and put that uh, under this quest. Apparently it's a point eight. Oh, hey, there's a cow here too? What? Actually, you know what? Before we do that, let's go cut down some trees and um, and, and make a crossbow before we do it. And also get enough wood to... Um, well, actually, that's what we're doing now, is we're getting enough wood to be able to make arrows or bolts or whatever you use on the crossbow. Let's grab that as well. The weather is pretty cool. Actually, the streaks on your screen on the screen are pretty amazing I think it's not much but it, it makes it makes it feel like we're we're actually in a rainstorm and I mean the color change of the sand is pretty cool too so there is damage happening to the axe but it is very minimal 
I really like that. Okay. Let's go ahead and head back. So our hunger is a little bit, but it's not affecting us yet. Uh, the weather is still amazing. And that looks like predators. And it is. Right next to my house. Fantastic. Uh, well, let's, uh, let's see if they're going to come after me. See the one. Let's make this crossbow pretty quick like. Alright, let's go ahead and make some arrows. Well, we have pests we gotta deal with, so why not, <laughs> why not deal with them? Uh, as soon as I shoot this though, they're gonna come bolting for me and I better be good with my reaction time. Because this is not going to be fun. That, I think that hit him. He's down. Yeah, I hit him all those times. A leopard. Alright. Well, the crossbow works. I guess I'm going to have to take that other leopard out too. It's, I mean, he's in my territory. I think I missed him. I can't tell. I think I missed him again. I think I was too high. Oh, that's not good. That's very, very not good.
All right. Ah, oh, the sky is crazy. It's like it's a negative, a negative uh, field of view, or a negative color. All right. Well, have some hides. We got some fur. Got some meat. We got some other things off of them too, didn't we? Fat. I have no clue what fat's used for. Let's wait for those all to be done. Oops. All right, let's see. We lost two arrow, one arrow it looks like. And we're down to four rounds on this gun. <laughs> this may be, um, may be a situation. Let's go ahead and go to the airstrip. We got food and drink on us. And see what kind of uh, mess we can get into. All right, so we're almost there, uh, but there's this other thing over here. I don't know what it is. It looks like ancient ruins or something. So we're definitely gonna have to go check that out afterwards. Let's uh, let's get up here and just see what this is about. So hopefully there's not too many people. Uh, we want to definitely be able to not die. <laughs> It's of course uh, rule one of all of all um, maritime. Oh, hello. Let's go ahead and put a mark here. That looks like um, iron right there. We don't need it at the moment, but it'll definitely become handy later on. So uh, yeah, wow, this is a great morning except for the uh, the lag. We're going to get over here, and then uh, I guess we're going to get off our horse and check the, check it out. Get everyone dead. Uh, hopefully we won't die ourselves. I think uh, that's kind of our our go-to at the moment is do, don't die. We don't, we don't want to die. So we need to be stealthy. Uh, look at that little deer. All right, I'm gonna get off here. Just the test, make sure everything's right. Good to go. I already see someone right there. But uh, this is kind of a close up weapon. So we're going to try to get him like right as he's getting to the end of his walk there. So let's uh, let's see if there's anyone else here. Looks like there's ammunition maybe. There's stuff all over the place here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wow, wow. I don't want to be hit by that. This, this kind of angle that it gives me. I don't like that. Oh, hello, hello. Uh oh, oh. Have I, can I, have I uh, kind of escaped them? 
So is it possible that I can... Nope, they're running in a little bit. Trying to find me. I can get this shot off. He's down. Okay. Oh my god, he has three friends over there. I could get these guys one by one without them seeing me. He's down. Wow, there's still a lot of guys right there. He's down. This is so cheating. They're like, guys, where's this coming from? Oh no, Charlie! What's happening? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I just took his helmet off. I didn't get him. He's got to be like right there. Or he's coming around. There he is. Oh, uh, really? That's going to act like a wall? No, no. <sighs> yeah, I hit his helmet, apparently. Mega pack, the backpack for sure. Clothing. Okay, that doesn't affect anything else. Hearing audio lags all over the place. Where does the weapon go? I don't know if you can hear those audio lags, but they are horrendous. Yes, please. Okay, let's go ahead and put that right there. Dude. I'll wipe these dudes out. I'm going to just get these guns away from them. And we'll, we'll pull them apart and... Headshot after a headshot is the only way this was possible. Strike you over here. That arrow out of your head and let's uh let's take a look. Not not walk away. A knife. I'm over overweight though. Let's uh, go ahead and drop rocks. Or give him rocks. No rocks? You got rocks. Take the soldier helm. I mean that seemed to help him. Why not help us? There we go. Dates. Trying to see which shirts these guys are wearing. Maybe the ones with the pockets actually have extra pockets. This guy looks like he's a he's a guy that would have stuff. Let's try 
try it out. Just see if it gives me anything. Nope. All right, and I don't think I have to search this guy, but search him anyway. Apparently we did get some honeycomb out of it. All right, still overweight by a lot, all these guns. I only need one of them. Here, let's search this guy again. Drop some guns on him. want one of each. Uh, didn't I get a med kit? I did. Let's go ahead and uh, use that. Let's eat as well. And let's get some water in us because apparently we're thirsty as all get out. Alright. That's done. <laughs> let's take a look around now. Alright. Q to repair. Vehicle condition is okay. Get in. What? What? I can actually drive? Wait a minute. The armor is low. I can actually drive in the desert? What the heck? Okay, wait a minute. Are, are these fuel barrels? Like, I can actually put fuel into like a canister because I made a canister I didn't know if it would work or not but uh can we can't do that there are these canisters over here though about the blue canisters can we do anything with them what about this nothing with that How do we get fuel? Is there a way to get fuel out of this one, maybe? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Take fuel. Am I taking fuel? How much fuel does my canister now have? Has four. Oh, wait a minute. How much uh, tools? Has six. Six of ten. Oh my goodness. All right, let's go ahead and keep taking. So here comes the question because I know I saw. Oh, well, let's take this tire too. You never know when things are going to need tires. I thought I saw something. But, uh, let's just walk around here a little bit. that that first off let's take a look at if the vehicle is okay how is the fuel or refuel this thing till this is completely empty okay fuel can is empty For inventory. Oh, you know what? I should have checked the inventory of that other one. Let's go check it. Actually, let's drive over to it. Why not? What? Are you kidding me? This is insane! We're traveling around in a tank, guys. Traveling around in a tank. Tap for inventory. That's 308. It's 104 rounds of 308. I bet that is a 308 gun. Holy cow, we just got a ton of ammo. We need to go to the other vehicle too. We need to get the ammo out of it. If this will let us. Uh, you know what? We're going to have to go this way.
This is insane. So let's see how this thing works. Is this going to... Oh, it's going to shoot one... It's going to shoot like a regular gun? <laughs> oh! Oh, really? Oh, really? <laughs> this is crazy. Alright, I'm going to say... Not all of it. Let's go ahead and take. I just want a hundred. There we go. The rest can go in here. Let's get in. Let's uh, let's explore. This is insane. Uh, maybe the vehicle, the wheeled vehicles are gonna be better than this but because this is running th through fuel pretty darn fast yeah maybe we should do that and go with a wheeled vehicle because this isn't going to be fast anyway it's a tank woo alright let's um let's get our can out and we're going to here take the fuel. And we're going to fill this one up. I don't want to take the tire, I want to fuel it up. This, this movement, after the movement fact, is so aggravating. I want to put the fuel back in. How much fuel does this have? Oh, it's full. So we just need to grab the ammo out of here. Yeah, this is definitely much faster. All right, let's go complete that quest. Who needs a horse when you have horsepower? <laughs> this is awesome. Oh yeah, there was that uh, that place over here that we were gonna check out. Look at that suspension. This is amazing. This is not something I expected in the game. I I knew that there was scrap in the game, uh, so that you could use for uh, for certain things. But what in the world? There's another cropping that doesn't look. Like the other stuff. Let's actually hit it. Gold ore. This is uh, one of our quests, I think. We need one more gold ore. There we go. Alright, let's move on. Thought the place was over in this direction, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's over there. I wonder if we need iron or if we need scrap to be able to repair this vehicle completely. But this is definitely not a uh, village of any type. Something. Like an ancient ruins or something. Huh. 
I don't want to break pottery and oh hi you know what Not drop, not drop. He's dead. And he's dead. Let's get my gun out just in case. This guy has got Bedouin rifles. some coin on them and a compass I'm guessing that's just for money oh is this a so I don't know what to do with this stuff I'm still overweight some by that oh I had another okay let's drop this there we go we're, we're good now give me your food and your money all right let's eat and drink Easy peasy. Oh, 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 oh. Not out of ammo for too long. All right. That was close. Just going to take the money. Ooh, and I'll take that as well. Boom, that opened up all those slots. You can take that then, and I'll take your dates. Thank you so much for uh, your cooperation. And uh, the, the affirmation, uh, the, not affirmation, what, I don't even know what words I'm trying to say now. And the completion of bettering myself. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, move on. Let's explore some more.
Let's see what we can get ourselves into. This is amazing so far. All right. Um, we do have that turn in. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go kind of this way. And uh, we'll we'll try to head towards uh, that after we get to this next destination. This is kind of nice though, having a vehicle like this. Uh, of course, you got to keep up with fuel, which means you got to find more vehicles that have fuel, uh, or you you run out. But the suspension on this thing is amazing. <laughs> the, uh, whatever physic engine or whatever uh, design they were using off of is really good uh, I, I approve five stars out of five on the vehicles <laughs> but we found gold we found iron and uh, we made a little bit of a little hut made a uh, some crafting devices and we're gonna go to this location and then turn in the quests that we have. We, we've we completed both of them. Oh my god. No, no. Don't break. Don't break. Oh my goodness. What in the world? What is this? Looks like a little village of some sort. Are there people here? It's a cooking pot. Some houses. Maybe I gotta get out of the vehicle for it to load in? Yeah. Okay, there we go. It loaded in. Bandit hideout. And then look at that. People just start popping up here. He's down. That's <laughs> so... That's so easy. So good. Don't you dare. Don't you dare get me stuck on this. Don't, don't you dare I get, get myself stuck on this thing. All right, let's get He's out. This thing is so easy and so amazing. I've almost gone through a hundred rounds so far. He's down. Hey, fella. He's dead. Nicely done, fellas. Nicely done. And we got water right here. Oh, hi. Hello. Okay, got him. Alright, let's check out these huts. Maybe there'll be uh, loot in them. Oh yeah. Some plant. Where's the entrance for this one? Okay. I 
nothing in there. Oh hey, there's a guy up there. Let's see if we can't snipe him from with our uh No, no uh, stuff there. What are you doing? What are you doing? What What's going on? What are you doing? Okay, I <laughs> just danced myself out of there. All right, I, I'm gonna say no to that one. We've already searched that. Is this the one I already opened? Clay. More water. Let's go check out these huts over here. See another big hut. Yep, another another chest in here. Tomato. Or for those who say it that way, tomato. Alright, let's uh let's get in our van truck and uh find uh find these quests and turn them in. This has actually been very uh, amazing. I, you know, I love the game already um, because of the fact that it's survival, it's crafting, it's in the desert. I feel we got a kind of a little bit of leeway with the fact that it's not really that hot. But uh, yeah, so we're heading back to the wheat, by the way, which is this way. And then we also have another quest we need to turn in back at the tents uh, for the gold. So we did pretty good. We're going to get 500 um, money from the first quest. Which it says it is 0.2 miles. That's not too far away. Our house is like right over there. And this vehicle is chugging along like a champ. So I wonder if you put scrap in here is what uh, fixes it. But I mean, I haven't had any problems with the car so far. Oh yeah, now it's now it's having some rendering issues because uh, again, it's not optimized correctly. So the it going through through the wheat is like destroying it. Five hundred smackaroos. All right, so we'll come back in here. We'll go to quests. We'll track that one, and that one is done as well. Where do we go for that one? It's over this way, right? To the Bedouin camp. We barely used any fuel so far, and we uh, we definitely have enough for more. You know, I kind of wish there was an actual plane at the airstrip that we could fly, so we could uh, explore further and farther. See, there's the camp up there. It's turning nighttime again. We're getting a little bit tired and hungry again. I hope it's leaving tracks in the dirt. It is. It's leaving tracks in the dirt. That's pretty awesome.
All right, let's turn this quest in. All right. Really? I had to have been, I had to have this quest highlighted for me to actually, I have the ore, don't I? I have three gold ore right there. Gotta be kidding me. Anyway, let's see what this guy's selling. Alright. Well, I think we did a really good job. We got a lot done. We got a vehicle. And uh, we're going to go check out one more place before we end uh, the video today. Uh, maybe two. Because this is only one, uh, point 0.1 mile away. And then we'll go check out this other one over here. And uh, finish it up. But as far as the game is concerned, it does need more optimization. Uh, it is still an alpha. Oh, I see a fire in the background. That is 0.7 miles. I thought it was 0.1 miles to where we were heading. But I'm definitely going towards the fire. And I see something up on that hill too. So we may do both. Having this is kind of cheaty though. So if... If it's a mission or something where we have to deal with someone. Oh, what's this? Nah, I don't want to do that. go ahead and check out this plane wreck though uh, looks like we're getting a little tired so uh, we're gonna have to deal with that but if you guys want to see me do more of this game definitely uh, leave a comment in the description below or in the not in the description in the comments below and uh, I will put a description in the description below for you. Um, it looks like we're going to have to be taking out some more militants of some sort. So let's see here. Tools. Got a knife. We could put a knife down here. We'll want to and just carve a little. Do a little bit of silent treatment. That guy is really close too. Once he stops, he's out. And if for any reason we get in a situation that we can't handle, we can always uh, head back to the truck for uh, protection. Lockpick. We can go check out what's in that guy's box. How much ammo do we have for for one of these? We got enough. Uh, my massacre. Do the massacre. Boom. He's out. Should have friends coming. Yep. Yep, yep. Another one. Oh! Oh! Sad to be you. Okay, he is the. Alright, let's delete it. Okay, wait a minute. I'm confused. Let's go ahead and drag you. I don't know how you got on top of him. Definitely take more honey. Take more honeycomb. 
pick this up just so we can get the ammo out of it. Then we'll throw it back on him. We'll take the ammo. There we go. That was a nice little nice little get. All right, let's um, let's eat. There we go. Drink. Kind of low on our on our water here. bit of walking around coin all right let's uh, move on actually um, nah we'll, we'll keep moving kind of enjoying just doing this I it may be a long video but I, I'm, I'm really just enjoying playing the game and having the tools that we have we should probably go sleep but if we can find that little lean-to what is this Oh, this is parts of the vehicle, I think. I think that was right over here, wasn't it? Uh, where I came from. There's the Bedouin camp. There it is, I think. Is that the lane two right there? Yeah, with that guy. All right. unlock this thing and if he cares I will make sure he doesn't care alright um, E that was an easy unlock bone knife I'll leave that alright one more location one one more location and then we'll, we'll uh, end it there we got one four miles, uh, point four miles. Let's go ahead and go to this one over here. Yeah, the game is very enjoyable. <laughs> I could honestly play this all day if it would let me. Uh, but I have, I have real, real people things, real people things I have to do. <laughs> Um, so there's a sheer cliff coming up. I was hoping that it would turn into a thing, but I'm pretty sure this cannot get over that. So I'm going to have to go around it. It's a weird place to put a sheer cliff, but it makes me want to drive a vehicle off of it as a finale, as a fin. Okay, what is that about? That's a star. Another ancient ruins. More bad guys. All right, let's. Uh, we've already done one of those. Holy cow! Um, yeah, let's go this way. You can do it, car. It's taking jumps pretty well so far. Like right there. All right, let's get centered up, man. If as long as you have a mission that leads you to uh, that leads you to um, a runway, you're gonna you're gonna be golden. You get a you get a vehicle out of it. And it looks like we're coming up on another group of. Um, Bedouins. Yep. Welcome to the Bedouin camp number two. Alright guys, I think we did a really good job actually. 
<laughs> we um we have conquered and uh we did uh more more than i actually thought we would let's see if i have some wood in my inventory i do let's go ahead and build a lean to so definitely want to save this and we'll save it as soon as we possibly can how far away do i have to be from bedouin camp uh, or am i missing something no it's just wood There we go. Right there. There we go. Save it. Save. Sleep. And we're out. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Cypher Deck. Peace out.